Hello everyone. So in this video, I'm going to give you a simplified solo acoustic version of how to play black. And I'm going to show you a couple of different ways just so you can use it as a stepping stone to progress to playing, you know. Okay, so there's a bunch of different chord shapes in there. So we're going to simplify it by playing some open chords first, and then I'll show you some other ones that you can use as well. So the first has got two chords in it. An E major and an A major. And you play one bar each of those, okay? So Okay, so that one is this chord, and then this one is an A chord. Same chord, it's just a different voicing, okay? Okay, let's build up this chord. You have your first finger on the first fret on the fourth string. So one, two, three, four, that is the E, A, D, G string, okay? Then your third finger goes on to the second fret on the next string down and your second finger goes on the second fret on the next string um, lower than that one, okay? So. So it should sound like that. Now when you change to the A chord, if you just take off these two fingers and then slide that finger up one fret, and then you put these two fingers either side of it on the second fret, you get a nice clean A chord with the open uh, E string as well, okay? And then to change back, take those two off, slide that finger down and apply those two again, okay? The next part is a C to an E minor and the C shape is like that. Okay. Pretty straightforward. The E minor is exactly the same as the E, but you just take your first finger off. And the C chord, it looks like that. I'll show you up there so you can see what it is properly, all right? Now, there's one more chord, and that is the D chord, okay? So when it goes to the part, and just after the chorus, you'll hear... And that loops around, okay? Okay, that's it. That is all you need to be able to play this, uh, this song. So that's how you play it with open chords. Now, there's another way you can play it, which is um, if you, um, and this is a little trick, if you wanna do this chord shape for the verse, to play the E, if you slide your finger, so if you fret it first like that, and then remove your first um, finger from that bar position, and slide it down so it's the, in the open position. So if, if there was a fret here, that's where your finger would be, okay? When you slide up to the fifth fret, you've already got these fingers in the right position, okay? Or in the, in the right shape, but then you move them to the fifth fret, and bar with your first finger on the fifth fret. You can move between the two chords easily. If you do this, you have to change every single one of your fingers. If you do it this way, you only have to add one finger. Okay, so it's going to make it a lot easier for you to change between the two. to the C chord, if you move it up three frets, one, two, three, you can do that um, same trick from the C chord to the E minor. But with the E minor, you are taking off two fingers, okay? So you take your first two fingers off and slide it down 
to the uh, to uh, the second fret, okay? <laughs> Now, you might actually find it easier to do this. Entirely up to you. And then you're just going to add some strumming to it. Nice and easy. Then into the bridge. And then the last part. So anyway, that is how you play black on one guitar. Um, hopefully that was useful to you. And stay tuned for more of these because these are good fun. So we'll see how popular they are, shall we? And comment below if uh, you've got one that you want me to, uh, to do on one guitar. And uh, I will endeavour to do so. Cheers for watching. See you later. Bye-bye.